Hi, Achim Schlöffel, Inner Space Explorers. Today it's uh, again a how-to video and um, a friend of mine has a problem with his dry suit. Uh, actually, it's leaking and he asked me if I could um, have a look at that and fix it and I thought it's a good idea to show you how I do that because I do it a little bit different and uh, talk a little bit of how to fix that. So, um, the leak obviously is somewhere in the crotch area and um, before we start with, um, with a real test with, um, with soap water and whatever, um, the easiest thing to do is always to see if you can detect the, um, the hole with a torch. So we take this strong backup torch and um, check the area where the hole might be. All right, so, I mean, you can see this is a real bright torch. And um, you can also, I mean, there's no light going through the material. So if there is somewhere like a, like a small pinhole or something, you would see this light go through, um, which is not the case here. So I think we have to do another test. Yeah. Actually, I cannot see anything here. All right, it was a try for a fast fix. So let's, um, let's do something else and um, test it with some soapy water. To test it with some soapy water, you need a little bit of equipment and uh, there's plenty of different uh, ways of how to plug these seals. Um, a lot of people take big water bottles or Coke bottles or something like that and bowls or, um, or pots from the kitchen uh, to seal the neck seal. But the problem is always that you have to put the suit on the floor, which always makes it dirty and messy, and I don't like that. So what I do is I take one of these ball fenders uh, from the boat and um, put that in the neck, and then I actually hang the suit on this, which means I have it free, I can spin it around, I can walk around it, and it's not in the dirt, so it's much more comfortable. The other thing is that if I want to inflate it, I want to turn it inside out, because um, if you take it uh, the way you put it on, um, it's not necessarily gas going out when water is coming in because um, the material has some sort of flex so you can have this effect so if the pressure builds up it can actually close the hole so you want it the other way around and then obviously the inflation is on the inside which makes it hard to inflate it so I took, uh, took these two plastic cups and I'll put those uh, in the wrist seals and in one of them you can see I installed um, one of these brass nipples um, for chromatic tools, like this. And I attached it all to a first stage on, on that tank and that's the way how we will fill it. All right, so we'll hang it up and you can uh, follow us on that. All right, so as you can see, I uh, hung my body up and uh, we'll give him some gas now. All right, so as you can see, our body here is now filled and uh, now we have some soapy water and we'll check for leaks. Right, uh, so you saw the leak, and um, that's actually a very small stitch. Uh, it's like with a needle, needle hole. So um, there's no need to put a patch on that. Um, so we can just seal it with Aquasure. And uh, an important thing you need to remember on Aquasure is that Aquasure is a sealant and it's not a glue. I see a lot of people trying to patch up things using Aquasure as a glue, and that doesn't hold very well. Um, so keep in mind it's a sealant, 
So you mix it with the, the thinner, the color hardener, and you use a small brush and you brush it on as a sealing surface and it will uh, perfectly cover up that hole, but uh, do not use it to glue patches on something because that doesn't work. All right, I hope the entire thing makes sense for you and it helps you if you want to fix your own suit. And uh, if so, please uh, give us thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And um, I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching.